pray the word of God. 1 John chapter 5 verses 14 and 15. Now this is the confidence that we have in him that if we ask anything according to his will, he hears us. And if we know that he hears us, whatever we ask, we know that we have the petitions that we have asked of him. These scriptures tell us that um, when we pray for something in the will of God, we receive it uh, and that our prayers are answered. And so it's important for us to firstly know the will of God concerning any matter. Uh, this could be with regard to healing of our physical body. This could be with regard to wholeness of our emotional person. This could be with regard to our finances. This could be with regard to our family. This could be with regard to absolutely anything that concerns us. But the requirement is to know what God thinks about that subject and what God has offered uh, through himself and the Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, for example, when we think about unsaved friends, uh, family members, uh, here's what the word of God says. The word of God tells us that he wants everyone to be saved and, and there's no doubt uh, about this desire of God. How do we know this? We know it from scripture. And I will read for us a couple of uh, verses from the Bible. 1 Timothy chapter 2 and verse 4. Who desires all men to be saved and to come to the knowledge of the truth. 2 Peter chapter 3 and verse 9. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, as some count slackness, but is long-suffering toward us, not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. So we have two and in fact many other scriptures that tell us that God wants everyone to come to the saving knowledge of the Lord Jesus Christ. And so the plan of salvation is for everyone. Whenever we pray that someone be saved, it is in line with the will of God. Even Jesus, Matthew 28, when he gave us the great commission, he called us to go make disciples of all the world. Uh, and so this matter is settled that God wants people to be saved. In the same way, when we study other subjects such as healing, deliverance, breakthrough, success, uh, we have an idea of what it is that God has pronounced in His Word. And when we pray in line with His Word, we have the answers for what we pray. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we thank you that your word is established in heaven forever. And God, we depend on your word, Lord. Thank you, God, that, that Lord, your, your word will not pass away, though heaven and earth will pass away. And Lord, even as we depend on your word, as we stand in confidence, Father, on your word, we thank you that, Lord, our prayers are more effective. We give you all the glory. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.